All right, guys, welcome back to our Mazayuki run. So this is going to be the last part for Mazayuki because we're going to be uh, retiring. <laughs> we're going to be retiring him. He's uh, already ill. I think he's. this is his last year, so we could be coming down to the last couple of months here. So I've been going back and forth on who to give it to. Uh, there's so many directions to decide who to retire in favor of but just to keep it kind of interesting for me I'm going to give it to uh, Nobuyuki's kid so instead of Yukimura who's already 44 man it's kind of crazy Mazuyuki's 64 Yukimura's 44 Nobuyuki who's the elder is 45 so you know what I'm just going to leapfrog them skip a generation Nobu Yoshi all the way on the bottom he just joined us last year so we're gonna give it to the kid all right he's got concerted attack eh, disaster readiness not great really but concerted attack 56 leadership 60 valor you know I see potential I see potential actually let me give him the uh, treasure first I don't know if the treasure transfers over or not but let me give it to him so we don't have to strip it from uh, Mazayuki that'd be kind of funny Hey, Grandpa, I need that compass. Start start everything off on the wrong foot by confiscating that. Alright, so let's give that to him to boost his stats up just a bit. Plus three and plus one. We'll take it. To receive this compass brings me a joy like no other. Right. It's just a compass. It's just a compass, kid. Get carried away. All right, let's do it. Prestige hit, of course. Not terrible. We're still at 140, so. I will lead and protect the Sonata with my life. Nobu Yoshi Sonata. Man, so this will be the last Mazuyuki part after this. We'll have to change the name. Nobu Yoshi. I could just see people scrolling through and being like, who the hell is Nobu Yoshi? Huh? Nobu Yoshi. Like I said, he's not terrible. I see potential. Now, let's put Mazayuki somewhere to just kind of, uh... I mean, I guess he could still march with us. Honestly. You know what? Let's do that. Let's put him as a substitute. He'll be like an advisor. He'll be like an advisor in Nobuyoshi's unit. I like that. I like that better than putting him in charge of a castle or something like that, you know? Okay, so... We've got that out of the way. We've got the retirement out of the way. That was a hard choice. I mean, Nobu, uh, Nobuyuki seemed like a good pick for me. Yukimura, of course. Just have Yukimura with the ton of soldiers from the main base charging out that would have been good too but yeah no we'll, we'll try nobuyoshi out this way the sonata bros can keep being the generals you know what i mean so everything's been pretty much the same if you guys have been following the run we're pretty much in the same spot the only decision i think is up north who to back the usugi who i, I assume are going to try to take back echigo at some point here or help the Maida clan. Um, helping the Maida clan would be a lot more difficult because they are facing off the Toyotomi. So that's the choice that we really have to make. Who to back here? Uesugi or Maida? I'm, I'm leaning towards Uesugi, of course, due to recent developments in my other runs. I'm kind of sour on the Maida right now, so. And y yes, I'm going to hold that against them, even though Toshi is gone. Over here in the south. I think I'm going to have to do two different marches. So if we look at the Tokugawa, Yukimura is right here in uh, Kofu Castle, Shingen's old uh, stronghold. So from here, I think what I'm going to do is have Yukimura rampage down here. Hopefully, we can just take these castles on the world map without having to fight any battles with uh, Yukimura and Sansaburo leading the charge. And then what I'm thinking to do here is gather our forces and fight a siege battle against the Tokugawa. So that's, that's where we're going. 
And that's where we're heading to next. That's the plan right now. We need to just really cripple the Tokugawa so that I, don't, I can just leave them be afterwards. Once I know that they can't recover, and then we can start focusing on the Toyotomi. The uh, final boss of the run, really. I need to put somebody in charge, but... Uh, all these guys can only hold one territory. You know, I need to put somebody who can actually develop this spot. I'll put him. Because this has the landmark that I haven't been uh, paying attention to. This whole game, I haven't been paying attention to the... Uh, the Takeda landmark that gives you plus one to all castles. Horse ranch, cavalry plus one. So if you have a uh, ranch, you get plus one more. As if the Takeda didn't have enough advantages. But for us, for the Sanada, that's going to be a huge deal. Oh shoot, I think we're fighting down here, aren't we? We're fighting and we're not winning. Right. Don't get hit. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Agitated. Great. I didn't even see this. Development rate 90% or more. Ooh. For four castles. Oh, we have to have four castles at 90% or more. This is a very strong landmark as well. Border disputes. Take care of that right away. So let's see. We've got Yukimura here. Sons of Burrows up here. Nobukatsu's here now. These three should be able to uh, put a dent. Can we win a siege battle over here? That's the real question. Especially coming a long way down here. I have an extract. I didn't even see that. Oh, Hiremasa. No, never. Never, Hidemasa. Two months with the Uesugi. Uh, who is this? Master Moon's uh, wife? Why is she, uh, okay. Oh, that's right. The Date are gone in this run. I keep forgetting that. They were wiped out in the last, uh... In the last upload that we did. They were taken out. So there could be some Date retainers floating around out there. Border disputes. I really can't stand these. When, when they start going off like this, it gets kind of oppressive. Yeah, this is getting crazy right here. Like I said, um, the Maida clan have been able to hold off only because they're holding exactly one point. So this guy, uh, the Toyotomi, keep marching out, running out of provisions, and heading back. Sooner or later, though, oh, that might be it. Hideyori himself with 27,000. Hideyori might be able to break through finally. I think once they get through here this clan will just completely collapse. So, we're working on a... We're living on borrowed time right now. So I'm trying to really get uh, things settled here with the Tokugawa, man. I need to, like, start heading west. But every time I try to do anything, I start getting pushed back. You know, they've already marched against me from here. So, I think the key is going to be to take this. That'll give me a couple of castles, I'm assuming. Once we cut them off, we just isolate the Tokugawa to these few territories. I think at that point, I can just leave them be. They might not be able to uh, really muster a threat. And then I can just create a province and focus on the west. 
Okay, Yukimura's about ready to march. Let's start with these guys back here. Start calling them down. This one, this one. Because they're not going to be too useful in the siege. So on the left side, we're just going to try to fight on the overworld map. Capture these beaten down Tokugawa strongholds. And we'll try to put a force together using our Kanto provinces to besiege uh, Kururi, Kururi Castle. Maybe I can get a destroy command off as well. Who's here? 4,000. Another border dispute. Man. That's three border disputes. In a row. One after the other. Sure. Ooh, now Yori... He's gonna instigate a betrayal within the castle. What castle are you in charge of? Oh, he's gonna give us this castle? Mm, but yeah, but that would cut us off. That would put us right in the middle of the Uesugi. I guess we could give it to them. Oh, but he wants to be, uh, he wants to keep the castle, does he not? This could be a problem. Let's just say yes for now, and we'll see if we can give the castle to the Yosugi. Alright, we'll take it. But don't drag us into a war between the Maida and the Yusugi, because that would be a problem. Let's just see if we can give it away. Cannot be improved. Okay, what about them? Oh, they're untrusting now. Great. I'm not defending your castle, so... <laughs> oh my god, I took... I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did that. I just... Oh, bad call. I think we stepped into it now. We might end up getting drawing the ire of the Mida clan for that. I can't see it not. I can't. I'm trying to work through the scenarios right now. I can't see the Mida clan not taking that personally. <laughs> oh, shit. That's my bad. That's my bad. You should have consulted Mazuyuki before before making that move, uh, Nobuyoshi. You can't just grab what's in front of you all the time. You gotta think about it sometimes. Alright, I need to put somebody here. There's 3,000 soldiers ready to march. Let's transfer somebody over. We can use them. They don't even have to be good. Three units heading down. Got two ranches. Where are they? Um, not great spots. Okay, don't want those. I guess at this point it'd be fine if the Mita clan start to fall apart since uh, I don't really want to deal with them. I really don't want any repercussions for taking that castle. Alright, I can't send everybody. 
I don't really trust this clan. They've never invaded before, but... Still, I don't trust them. Go, let's go, let's go. Down the pass. Link up with Yukimura. Prepare to rampage through Tokai. Are we dealing with the Yusugi? Do we have a messenger? We're at 16. So our alliance is going to expire. I guess maybe then I can give them the castle. I really don't want this castle. It's not a good spot. I mean, geez. Like I said, I just stepped into it there by taking that deal. I think we'll head for this one first. No, actually, because this, this will bring us into contact with those clans. Let's take these castles first. More labor, that's good, I need it. I need that labor. Okay, now that we're at a truce, now we're normal. Okay, maybe now I can give him the... Nope, we still can't give him the castle. <sighs> Destroy. Yes, let's do that. Good suggestion. Where is Date? Did he join the Yusugi? No. The Nanbu then. They must have gotten him. There he is. Masumune Date. Loyalty of four. Holy crap. I don't know how he doesn't quit the force. I've never seen the Nanbu clan get that strong before. I wonder what they're going to do if they're going to if it if it's going to be an all out war here on the border or what. All right, that's taken care of. Military road work. Oh, I don't see that being useful. All right, let's start hitting the castle. Tribes first. Just throw everything you got at it. I could even use your Kimura to block the road here so that these reinforcements can't get here. Let's try that. Yeah, I figured. Okay. So they shouldn't be able to, uh, if Yukimura stands right here at this crossroads, they, they won't be able to reinforce their castle. They'll just have this castle here, and if we attack that, if we attack this castle, wait, no, 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 the castle. Right, so we go after that castle there. Here, let's go. One north, one south. Two north, so that we can occupy. Occupy that a little bit faster. This guy's not ready because he doesn't have the supplies. I actually wonder if this... Like, does he have uh, irrigation set up here or no? Oh, there is. Okay, then we just have to wait. We just gotta wait for that to get built up. Supplies and all that. We need a new headquarters. You know, Ueda Castle, it's got a lot of soldiers, but it's very small for uh, actual buildings that we can put up. Uh, we need to get Sunpu. You know, we need to get Sunpu. Sunpu would be a great headquarters. We, I mean, Shingen's could work as well. Kofu Castle. But Sunpu has a special place uh, in my heart. Nothing but good memories. 
I don't know if I want to build anything up there. Trading towns, keep doing that. And let's see. Maybe we can search. I mean, the Date officers might be out there. Nope. Scratch that. Okay, everybody here. Sansuburo, everybody. Hit the castle. Yukimura will stand guard. None shall pass. Uh, grade 3 treasures, which we cannot afford. There's actually a game that you have to play with the market where you actually don't want to stockpile too much gold because it automatically jumps you up. It automatically pushes you up because it sees that you hit a new cap. So if you stockpile, but you that's not your, you know, your income isn't sustained at such a high level, you get locked out of buying stuff. Everything gets too expensive. Like right now, it moved me up another tier with treasures. You know, the game is assuming that I can afford to buy that grade, and I can't. It's just that I'm saving up. And it's kind of annoying to trade. Odawara is great, but it just doesn't see any use. Like, unless you're playing Hojo early on, I don't know what kind of action this castle is ever going to see, you know? And it sucks because it's such a cool castle. Yep, truce is going to end. Okay, that castle is quickly been, being beaten down. Very quickly. All right, we're blockading. Did he deploy? No, he went back into the castle. 50 days of supplies. That's not enough, man. Uh, might as well just start storming a bit. Yukimura's just holding the road. Oh, the destroy didn't work. Damn. I needed that to work. That would have really sped things up. All right. <laughs> Might as well attack Sunpu. Just dividing their forces. Alright, he's blockading. I think he can blockade for a little while. No. Okay, let's see. We still have one more point to occupy here. Right, tribe can leave. Both tribes are already done. Okay, that took everything they had. I guess we'll concentrate. Yeah, we'll just concentrate on this castle. With our other two units. Concentrate everybody that we have left, I mean. Okay. And as far as the siege goes down here... How's Edo Castle looking? We need to build stuff here. Nobuyuki is going to be the key to that siege. Nobu Masa Sanada. Nobuyuki. Oh, Nobuyuki's other kid. Okay. Nobuyuki's second son. I didn't know he had two kids. I thought he only had one. Ujizane finding one sided spear. Alright, nice. Still waiting for Ujizane to hit a high enough rank so I can use Way of the Imagawa, which is an incredible. Um, 
an incredible policy. No, we don't need that. We're going to take the castle. Let's do that. Why not mess with them? Yukimura is a one-man wrecking crew. Sun Poo Castle has fallen. Yes. Oh boy. Okay, we will not return. Only one castle left. Let's push towards it. It's a lot of soldiers, but there's always a chance. Okay, this guy's got... Somebody here is almost out. This guy. Tadamasa is out of there. Yukimura is pushing for the last castle there. The last two castles that the Tokugawa have in Tokai. Let's get this training grounds up over here. Nobuyuki needs more soldiers. Oh man, there goes Mazuyuki. Our liege lord. Ten good years, man. Mazuyuki built the foundation. He built us up. Now it's up to the uh, the rest of the clan to finish what he started. Uesugi. Can we give them back the castle? We cannot. What is this? Oh, they must have a uh, a truce, right? Yeah, they've got a truce with the Maida for some reason. Truce over what? Oh, maybe they had an alliance. It expired. Alright. We need to take these last two. Yuki's here. This guy's over here. This guy's no slouch either. Let's put a training ground here. And bolster his soldiers as well. Alright, this castle's pretty much done. Who's got the most supplies? This guy? I'm going to try to send him to help uh, Yukimura. Let's see. Non-stop border disputes. Wow, they refused, huh? Oh, okay. Let's see if we can get the one guy. Does he have Code of the Priest? Yes. Oh, and he has Confuse. 72, though. Damn. A county with a temple. And that's... County with the temple. Yep, there it is. Okay. There you go. So now we've got access to Code of the Priest, which is the XP one. Which I've kind of been wanting to ex experiment to see if it's... If it does actually increase XP for your officers or not. It's kind of hard to tell. Alright, 
he's riding over there. Actually, we've got Nobutada's here. He's got a hundred days of supplies. Let's see. Uh. All right. Be the last Tokugawa stronghold on this side. See if Yukimura's got enough gas left in the tank to take that. And then we just need to conduct a pretty large siege here. Deal the Tokugawa another blow. Actually, I might have to have to. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to chew through these guys first. Satomi, they've got ten thousand. What would our chances be against the uh, high chance of destroying? Okay, so no worries, we can soften them up. Let's set that as our target. Oh man, Yukimura's already beating the crap out of it. Sixty days until we're ready. That's oof. Okay. How much do I need to open up a console seat? One hundred and sixty-four gold. Okay, next month. Another border dispute. Oh my god. Yukimura needed no help. No help at all. He did it himself. Wow. That's... That's power. Okay. Let's open up that council seat. A ton of cash, but... You can decrease standing army, irrigation. I think it's going to have to be... Oof. I'm looking at irrigation, honestly. Let's look at the expenses. Could get standing army and then knock off thirty percent. Yeah, let's do that. We'll go for standing army. Actually, I might get a bigger discount. Hmm. Tough call. Yeah, I'm gonna do irrigation. Double up on irrigation. And we can do this. More soldiers, more crops. Pretty kind of boring, but right now we need more efficiency so we can. Uh, if we're going to have to punch through double two sieges, man, this is definitely going to be an opportunity for Nobu Yoshi to uh, make his mark. He's going to have to punch through two sieges. Let's go look at this mess over here. Still holding. Yeah, I'm gonna keep holding until the and unless the Toyo told me try to go around or something. But it's crazy, right? It's been it's been like this for a long time. Maybe that's why Yoshitsugu was able to hold off for a while too. Their AI just takes bad angles. Well, Nobutada showed up just in time to just see the castle fall, I guess. See Yukimura's handiwork up close. Oh yes, we may yeah, definitely go back. Okay. Alright guys, well, I think that's a good spot to end it for now. And the next one, we will conduct... Oh man, the first of two sieges, honestly. I'm gonna have to do it. I have to punch through two sieges, so we're gonna see uh, what Nobu Yoshi can do. 
young Nobuyoshi. He will be tested. But he's not alone. He's going to have Yukimura. His father, of course, Nobuyuki, will be there. So, uh, yeah, make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're going to keep going with this run. We're going to be starting a new live stream run pretty soon. The Nobukatsu run. I've got one more, uh, one or two more live streams on that, and then we're going to start a new live stream run. But as for this one, we're going to keep going for a little while longer. So, until we can have our big battle, our big Sekigahara against the uh, Toyotomi regime. So, I'll see you guys on the next one. Till then, take care.